Welcome back to the shelter. In uh, this episode, we are going to place this log we debarked last time on the shelter. And hopefully we are going to place some more logs. But first we're going to cut those trees down. A lot to do. Let's get to work. Now the log is cut to length, I'm going to make the rough notches. I'm placing some log cleats on the log so it won't roll while I'm cutting. Both rough notches are done, and we're gonna place it all again. I just made a mistake or ran into an issue. This log over here, it has shifted, or it was shifted, so that the line was visible, like half a centimeter or so and I just made this scribe line I'm just removing it with the back knife draw knife and I have to redo this long groove again also I'm going to remove it on this log so note to self just before you are scribing just make sure that the logs below are on the scribe lines so you don't have to do what I'm doing now and have to remove it again. Okay, I'm just gonna remove the scribe line so I don't get confused by leaving two scribe lines. Everything is scribed now and we're going to cut it out. Everything, long groove, notch, flyways. First two cuts each side on the long groove, about 45 degrees in. Now I'm gonna make the two last cuts to get the piece in the middle off. Everything is cut out and sanded. Now I'm just gonna brush and then we're gonna make a test fit. another log on the shelter and we have reached the height of the rear wall the wall behind 
and it's not going to be any higher than that. So now I found a log in my pile, I actually found two that I can use for the next logs that is going uh, between these, uh, the front and the back wall. Good morning, it's the next day. Today we are going to place the two logs we debarked yesterday. And we're going out in the forest to get another tree that we will use for some part of the roof structure. So that's the plan, let's get to work. Everything is dry now and we're going to cut out all the pieces of the log. There we go. The log is ready to be placed on the shelter. It's a beautiful fall. This week is extremely hot in Denmark. The trees are beautiful, all the different colors. Okay, on with the lock and on to the next one. I'm using some uh, rebar rods to put in between to stab uh, stabilize the locks. And then I'm going to uh, Knock that one a few centimeters down, so there's room for the settling. I just put the lock holder on my car, and now we are going to find some more trees in the forest. Almost complete, looking good. We just arrived in the forest where I felt all the other trees and there is actually a tip that I can use that my idea was that I would cut out and leave for the forest service but I actually think it's perfect for one of the roof rafters that one so I'm just going to cut it out in, in length the four and a half meters I need and bring it back to the shelter. Yeah.
this block is perfect for the two next front pieces to the shelter. So back with it to the shelter. We are not done yet. We need one more scene from down the slope, the hill, <laughs> like all the other times. This is what you call behind the scene. Down with the camera. Okay, so just wait a few seconds. I'll be back with a log. Okay, the log there, we just brought back. We are going to place in the front. I'm going to cut it in half and place at the front. The next log at, in the front, besides those two, is going to be one straight all the way across. And that's the opening of the shelter. Yes. I just made the markings for the rough notch. You're gonna cut it. There we go. Rough notches on both logs. They're both both. Uh, Blocked up. Now we're gonna scribe the logs and place them after we cut them out, of course. Yep. Everything is cut out. I'm just going to check again that uh, there are no hangers or possible hangers in this notch. And I do this with a square where I just follow the line, the edge where all the weight is resting on. And if there's nothing in between, there's a space from the edge to edge. Then it's fine. It looks great. As you probably have noticed, 
I have ran out of moss, but it's fine. It's a shelter. It doesn't have to be insulated. It's gonna be open all year round. And it's looking good. It's a fit. <laughs> Perfect. Tight, tight fit. And you can see the line down here. That's uh, the underscribe, the, the half centimeter that when the notch, the tree is settling, it will slide down and the gap will disappear. And it's a fit, again, <laughs> perfect. That is it for this episode. We got a few logs placed on the shelter and next time, sorry not this time, but the next episode we will begin building the roof structure. I brought all the logs back this time. I'm going to debug them now before I'm leaving and next time they'll be ready and nice to scribe for the roof. So take care guys and see you in the next episode. Bye.